वेलकम टू माई YouTube चैनल दिस इज अदिति गुप्ता योर एनालिटिक्स मेंटर आई एम अ वर्किंग प्रोफेशनल एंड अ कॉर्पोरेट ट्रेनर सो गाइज आई हैव क्रिएटेड दिस पर्टिक्युलर चैनल टू मेक यू गाइज अवेयर अबाउट डेटा एनालिटिक्स बिजनेस इंटेलिजेंस एज पर माई एक्सपीरियंस एंड एक्सपर्टीज आई वॉन्ट टू गाइड यू ऑल दैट हाउ यू कैन ऑल्सो मेक योर करियर इन दिस पर्टिक्युलर डोमेन आई एम अ सी यू एंड फाउंडर ऑफ टेक्टिव ट्वेंटी फोर वेयर आई यू नो प्रोवाइड एजुकेशन रिगार्डिंग एनालिटिक्स डोमेन विजुअलाइजेशन domain and the business intelligence domain so guys this video is all about like how you know i started what's my journey and how i got my first job as a data analyst i hope you guys are very excited to listen the same that you know if you want to start as a fresher as well how to get your first job i know it's not that easy it's very complicated you need to first of all upgrade your skills then you need to create the resume and then simultaneously apply for a jobs as well but that's completely okay guys and everyone have their own you know journeys so make sure that you watch the video till the end so that you will get a proper end to end guidance about the domain which is data analytics and how you can get your first job in this particular domain as well before i start my journey do subscribe the channel so that you are, you will not miss any updates in future and you will get all the videos updates as soon as possible or as soon as i you know upload on my channel and don't forget to hit on the bell icon as well okay so let's get started first of all my journey in here so let me just give you a basic introduction about the background about my ad- academic background so guys i have done bachelor's in computer application then i have did masters in business intelligence business analytics from victoria university australia and then i have you know done with my phd as well from sis school of business management switzerland so after my phd and uh, you know during my masters i have uh, did multiple internships as well in the data analytics domain i have worked with multiple agencies before in the last company that i have worked is capgemini capgemini is one of the top agency one of the top linkedin companies and more than 4 lakh employees you know 4 lakh plus employees worked with capgemini and i was one of the consultant there worked with power bi and worked with other business intelligence and data visualization tools that's my you know academic background and that's the professional background i am core in data analytics and business intelligence domain but it's not like you know if you are from you know btech or bsc bba or any other academic background or if you have any other domain let's say sales marketing billing finance if you have worked with any department or any industry that's completely okay you can also make or transit your career in data analytics okay so let me tell you how i started and how i landed up in my first job so guys how i started is first of all understand one thing you need to be a graduate okay let's say if you're not graduate yet you can start freelancing in this domain but if you want a proper full time job then you need to be a graduate okay so first of all take a have a graduation degree if you can graduate from a computer science or uh, you know some uh, technical that's well and good but if you have graduated from a non tech domain as well that's completely okay because here what is the thing which is very important to make your career in data analytics is having expertise on a tool and having end to end projects okay so have a graduation degree and after that don't feel like you need to do a masters for the same or you need to be a phd or you know uh, you need to do internships or something like that if you want to just start it then you need to be graduate and after that you need to work on some projects okay so how what i did is i you know uh, graduated in bachelor's in com- computer applications then i have did masters in business analytics and with the masters i have learned a lot of tools like power bi and tableau and we have sap analytics cloud sac and during my masters itself i feel like okay this is something i can make my career in and this is something i would love to do like building visualization 
and guys in this domain there is no as such repetitive task you need to do you can work as per your flexibility and every day you need to do some meaningful and competitive task that will make your job so meaningful and that will make your job so interesting for sure okay so what you need to do is have a graduation degree after that learn top business intelligence tool okay so as soon as i completed my graduation i took admission in the masters and after that i worked on a data visualization tools i learned power bi okay power bi is one of the data analytics and business intelligence tool i have worked or i have learned sec as well which is sap analytics cloud as of now as far as the today's market is concerned i highly recommend you to start with power bi okay once you learn power bi then make sure that you complete at least 4 to 5 projects in power bi okay once you complete four to five projects in power bi then showcase all these projects make sure i'm repeating it again showcase all these projects on linkedin okay linkedin is something which is very important to work with apologies for my writing i'll gonna write it again <laughs> so here we have linkedin okay now when it comes to linkedin you need to showcase all the projects also update your fully bio as well okay like uh, what is the technology knowledge you have your about your experience if you don't have any experience then at least write about the projects write about the data sets and so on okay once you upload everything on your linkedin profile make sure that you create your portfolio okay what is portfolio like whatever the projects you uploaded on linkedin that's okay but you need to create your portfolio let's say whatever the projects let's say you have completed 10 number of projects that 10 number of projects needs to be at a single place okay so it can be on a github or a drive so i will just try drive in here or it can be on github as well okay or it can be on linktree links linktree is the platform from where you can just upload all the links together at one place okay so upload all your projects portfolios and uh, after making the portfolio then you need to focus on your resume building it's very important resume resume in the sense like whatever the linkedin profiles you have or whatever the portfolios you have created upload all the links in the resume and once your resume got updated then you need to properly apply for the jobs from linkedin as well you can apply for a jobs because i landed up in my first job and the last job which is in capgemini through linkedin only so i have a very good trust on linkedin so make sure that you upload everything on linkedin and apply on jobs through linkedin profiles only okay make sure that there needs to be job alerts make sure that whatever the job you want to apply go to the linkedin profile here is a job section click on a job section and whatever the profile you want to apply in and right now just enable a job alert for the particular profile i want to tell you one more thing guys if you are making a career in the domain which is data analytics then make sure that um, you know uh, the profiles which will be open for you is data analytics okay after learning power bi or after you know getting experience in a business intelligence tool you can apply as a data analyst you can apply as a business intelligence analyst this is b i a okay business analyst as well you can apply as a data visualization specialist dvs you can apply as a power bi developer pd you can apply as a power bi uh, you know developer analyst or i would recommend you to apply as a power bi consultant okay and then we have power bi specialist as well developer consultant specialist data analyst business intelligence business intelligence analyst data visualization specialist like all these profiles will going to open for you as soon as you get expertise in power bi okay so what i did is i have covered all this particular steps and that's how i land up in my first job as a data analyst okay i would highly recommend you to follow all these steps and if you want to learn power bi if you don't have any information about the same if you want to just starting your journey in this particular domain then you can join my live workshop as well end to end where i'll going to cover about power bi about this data analytics industry as well 
Okay. So check out the description for each and every link to follow on my Instagram profile as well. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Have fun. Until then, take care.